I can do this, you can do this because what am I doing? Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel, Nia Bia TV. If you're new here, then I'm Nia. If you're not new here, then welcome back to my channel. If you can tell by the title or you can tell by my hair, I'm going to be trying this wig. This is a closure wig from Uni's Hair. It's the Deep Wave, I believe. I'm going to put the correct length and wave type in the description box. So make sure y'all look for all the links. If you're like me and you've always been like intimidated by the lace and putting on lace, then watch this video because if I can do it, you can do it. I promise you. I brushed out the curls because I like really big hair. It was really easy to put this on. Without further ado, let's just get into the video. Okay, so now the hair is all braided down. Y'all know my hair is really thick, so I hope it looks flat. I'm just about to oil my scalp with this castor oil. Now I'm about to put on my cap. Y'all, our scalp is lighter than our skin though, so I never understand when people put a whole bunch of makeup because our skin, scalp is like this color, so I'd be confused, but I'm going to do a side part. So this is the wig. I bleached the knots, but I forgot to get the purple shampoo out the store, but I still don't think it looked, you know, that bad. It is tinted. This is Deep Wave, I think. I'm gonna put everything in the description though. And this is a 24 inch, I believe. It's already plucked, but I think I might pluck it some more. But this is how it looks. I kinda don't like the cap. Like, should I just put no cap on? Let me see. I think I'm gonna do no cap. Yeah, I feel like it would be better without a cap. Put my combs in on the side. I want to do a side part, but I don't want it to be like a deep side part. I want it to be like kind of wild curls. I want it to look like it's coming out my scalp. Like, let me brush it up some more. So now I'm about to cut this lace. Got an eyebrow razor. I say to cut it in like a zigzag. Okay, so I'm going to pluck it just a little bit. Just a little bit more so that it looks more natural. I'm just randomly pulling. If I can do this, you can do this because what am I doing? though this feels very like secure maybe I should move it more to this side though so now I'm gonna put some Gatsby glue no this is not actually glue for all my natural hair people out there or people who don't wear wigs who don't know because I remember when I first heard about it i was like i think i want to put glue on my hair it's not really glue okay so don't be alarmed you want to put it where you're going to put your wig Y'all see that melt? I ain't never put on a wig a day in my life myself. So. I say it feels really secure too. I'm not exaggerating or anything like that. So they sent me this too. So I'm going to put it on. And it got Velcro on it. Boom, boom, boom. 
Or should I get my hot comb? Just want it to look natural as possible. I'm gonna go ahead and cut my baby hairs. Let me adjust this in the back too. Adjusting thing in the back. Maybe I should put a little makeup on it. Put a little bit of makeup on it. I think this is cute. I love a messy look. Like I want it to kind of like be thrown, you know, over in a way. Use a little bit of makeup from this. I use a little bit of style factor. I'm back. I got some loose. So I'm just gonna put a little bit like on the ends. Okay, y'all. So I'm about to take it off. I have put on my thing again. But I think it's pretty cute. Super soft. And it was super easy to put on. Like I, I've always been intimidated, intimidated by um, wigs because I'm like, I don't know how to put them on. like comment and share i love this like it's so cute i'll see y'all in my next video bye I love this video. I really do.